Hey guys, welcome to my new video. In this video, I will show to make this animation with After Effects. Let's get started. So guys, welcome back and in this video, I will show animation ways for After Effects beginners. So first of all, let's select this background layer and look here, then select this layer main and go to solo and let's press P. Let's move it down like this and make new parts in keyframe and let's go to 10 keyframes. For shortcut you can use hold shift, press page down in keyboard or let me show other way, click time duration, write plus 10, click OK. And let's move it up. OK, go to 10 keyframes, let's move it down again, go 10 keyframes, move it up. And again, go 10 keyframes, move to down, and again, move to up, and again, move to down, and again, move to up. So we have more keyframes for easy and bones animation. Select keyframes, make easy or click F9. Let's say animation. Okay, not bad. So select these all keyframes. Let's right mouse, go to keyframe interpolation, change auto bezier to linear. Click OK, let's animation again. OK, that's good. And go to first second, let's hold shape, press S, open scale and click this icon. Let's change scale like this. Make scale keyframe and go to here. Change scale 110. Go to 10 keyframes, change 95. Again, go 10 keyframes, change 105%. And again, go 10 keyframes, change 100%. So, select keyframes, make easy. Let's see. Okay, select scale keyframes, move to right. Okay, that's good. So, right now, let's unsolo this main layer and select these all objects. Okay, let's link to layer main. And let's see. OK, and select these, all these elements, let's move it down like this, OK, and let's select this, let's move to here, and this move to here, OK, so in this time, I want to move the anchor points down like this for scale animation. Let's first select this layer 1 and go to pen behind, move the anchor point down like this, click section 2 and move to here. Select layer 2 and let's move to here this anchor point, let's go to pen behind, move the anchor point down, click section 2 and layer cloud 1, it doesn't matter for move the anchor point center. Select layer 3 and go to pen behind, move the anchor point down, click station 2 and let's put here this and layer 4. Let's go to again pen behind, move to here, click station 2, move to down like this and select airplane is not important and layer 5, go to pen behind, move the anchor point down, click station 2 and move to here and layer 6, move to down, and layer 7, move to also down anchor point, and click station 2, move to down a little bit like this, and layer 8, move to here, and move to down, layer 9, move to down this plant, click station 2, and move to down, and layer 10 and for shortcut you can use Y in keyboard for enable anchor point and move to down again click V for selection tool and move to down select layer 11 press Y move to down and click V and layer 12 go to Y and V again make some for this and this layer let's move it up a little bit and 16 let's move to down anchor point and this layer 
let's move to down and this plant move to anchor point down okay so select this layer bus let's move it up and this ship and this and okay so in this time we can make animation with scale two frames or we can use animation composer 3 so i will show two ways both let's select this layer one and let's zoom in so in this time let's press s open scale and change scale zero make scale two frame go to 10 two frames change scale 105 go to 10 two frames change 95 go to 10 two frame change 100 percent so select two frames make easy select work area let's preview animation okay that's good so other way we can use animation comes here. let's go to window open animation comes here 3 and right now open starter preset and we can see here more animations we can use all of them and let's open to the layer i want to use our shot scale or this okay so select this layer 2 and let's use overshot scale click in and let's move to right this layer let's see okay select this mark move to right for slow animation okay that's good so this is way 2 and I will use keyframe way select this layer 2 and go to click remove close animation comes as 3 and let's move to left this so in this time let's see timing okay layer 1 let's select keyframes let's move to left and copy these keyframes with ctrl c and go to first second Select these layer 2, 3, 4 and other layers without layer clothes. And let's select work area and control V for sketch frames. Let's see. Okay, and select this layer 1. Let's move to right. Let's move to here and layer 2 moves right and let's layer 3 and 4 airplane and 5 select all these layers and cloth layer 10 11 and 12 again cloud layer and 13 14 again cloud layer and 15 and let's move right like this okay so let's say animation okay not bad so select these layers let's select this cloud move to here select these all these layers and move to left okay that's good we can move to left more nice and let's select these layers and select this bus layer let's move to left and after scale animation let's press u and press p make new passing keyframe go to here let's go to seven second press n for select work area and let's move to right this bus to right okay let's select second nine and select work area select this last keyframe move to right let's see okay that's good so select this ship layer let's go to here press p make new passing keyframe and let's move to right go to here and move to left let's 
it's in the same of the down and down a little bit like this okay very nice So select this ship layer, move to left and press P, make new passing keyframe, go to last keyframe, move to right and select this car layer, move to here and go to here, press P, make new passing keyframe, go to next keyframe here and move like this. Go to here, move to up and here move to down. Okay, that's good. So let's make animation for other layers, for example, clothes and airplane. Let's select this airplane, let's go to here and press S, change scale 0. Make scale keyframe and go to here, change scale 100%, make keyframes easy. And let's select this layer, move to here. And change rotation like this so go to here let's press P make new passing keyframe hold shift press air make rotation keyframe go to here and let's move to like this chain rotation okay and let's here change this animation curves and let's select these Last keyframe. No, let's go to here and move to right, chain rotation, and go to here, move to right, and here, move to right, like this. So we can add here new curves, and here, okay. Okay, let's see. Nice, not bad. So in this time, let's select this layer clothes and go to solo. Let's press P and hold Alt, click this time duration. Open expression and let's write here wiggle one nine. And for the next expression, click this empty area. Let's see. Okay, this very fast. No, wait. Okay, let's change this 11. Okay, that's good. So let's copy this expression, copy. And also we can copy expression here. Let's select this and right mouse. Copy expression only. Let's unsolo. Let's see other clothes. Select this cloth. Press P and select here. Go to edit and paste. Okay, nice. Let's go to solo. Nice, it works. And select this clothes layer. And let's go to edit. Oh, let's press P. Select this position. Control V. For just paste expressions and select this cloud layer let's press p select position ctrl v and this cloud press p select position ctrl v select this balloon and press p ctrl v and okay that's good let's animation again nice so let's animation these red bands Close all these settings and I will show very easy way for make this animation. Select layer 1, go to solo and select pen behind, move to anchor point, right, click session 2 and let's move to right this layer, press S and click this icon change scale 0, make scale keyframe and go to here, change scale 100%, make keyframes easy, select work area, let's see, okay, let's select keyframe, move to left for fast animation 
In Civic Layer 2, let's go to Solo, move to right, and go to Pain Behind, move the anchor point down, Clization tool, and press S, make scale keyframe, chain scale 0, and go to here, chain scale 100%. Okay, and make two frames easy, move to left, and layer 3, go to solo, and move to right, and select pen behind, move to anchor point left, clearization tool, okay, and press S, click this icon, make scale two frame, change scale 0, and go to here, change 100%, make two frames easy. See, okay, move to left like this. Okay, let's hold shift, press P, make new pass in Q frame, and go to back. Let's move to right like this, and move to left Q frame, make two frames easy with this animation. Okay, that's good. So select this layer 4, go to solo and move to anchor point here, clearization tool and move to right, press S, make scale two frame, move to right and change scale 0. Make two frames easy. Let's move to left. Okay, and final layer 5. Go to solo and let's unsolo other layers. Select only layer 5, go to solo and select pen behind. Move to the left, clearization tool and move to the right this layer. And press S, click this icon, make scale 2 frame and move to the right, change scale 0. Make 2 frames easy. Okay, let's unsolo. Let's see timing. Okay. Nice, but we can make this way fast. Let's move to left these all layers. Okay, nice. So finally we can add here text let's close these layers and select these red band layers let's see timing and move to left okay and go to text let's write here happy world clearization tool change font style gallo drive and change font size move to here so, go to a game window and open animation comes here 3 and open starter preset and text layer anime character. Let's select this overshot. Okay, let's click in. Close composition and select this text. Move to right mark for slow animation and let's move to right this for perfect timing. Okay, let's link to main layer. Let's move to a little bit. Okay, nice. Let's do full animation. Very good. So guys, thank you for watching my video and don't forget to subscribe channel, like video and please follow me on Instagram. Good luck.